And Chess.com is here with Chinese number one, Ding Liran. You guys managed to do what no one else could do, which was beat Poland. Tell us about your game today. You sacrificed a piece, and you were down the piece for quite a long time. How much of that did you see? Yeah, today is a very difficult game. Uh, I, I divided from Rook A1 that I can um, make draw, but I saw the team com team uh, team condition is very very unclear. So I decided to play play on to play Rook E2. Of course, this is a very risky move. I saw A5, then I must play D5. Then uh, position very complicated. And after he played Queen F6, I step spend about 30 minutes here. And at first I thought what must be better, but then I realized it's not so easy. At first I would like to play Bishop G5. If he take the knight, I will play Rook C1, trap his queen. But I was afraid of Queen G6. Then I don't know how to continue, but finally I saw this. Um, knight b5 sacrifice the piece. Uh, actually, uh, at first I thought he would play h6 instead of queen g6. If I play rook d6, f4, queen h5, then he have bishop g4. But after h6, white had queen h5, and this is very, very important. I think after queen h5, black is losing. Well, it was a fascinating game, and I'm sure it's going to take somebody an hour to go through all of the analysis. But let me ask you some other questions. Uh, we are, we're friends, I guess. I'm holding you up here. Um, you have a hip injury you're still recovering from. How does your health feel? Uh, I feel much better. Uh, I didn't feel much pain, just uh, a little. Yeah, I, I will do exercise every day with my legs and of course it will influence the games a little bit because uh, I have to um, w um, drink lesser water because going to the bathroom takes too long yeah yeah was there was there any moment in this Olympiad where you really had to use the bathroom but you did not have time to use the bathroom uh, no 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 okay yeah <laughs> My and you're also you also have a special chair, is that right? Uh, yeah, yeah. And because I feel much better with this soft chair. The normal one is too hard, I think. Let me ask you: You were in a bit of danger yesterday against Shakri or uh, Some people were thinking that your unbeaten streak might come to an end. Do you think about the streak when you're playing chess? Uh, you mean yesterday? Yesterday, yeah. Today you were fine. Yeah, well, of course, I was very dangerous. Yeah. Also, I didn't see the winning line for him during the game, but I believe he he should be winning. And actually, he missed several winning chances when I analyzed. But but do you ever think about this big number? You're up uh, more than 80 games without a loss. Do you ever think about that during your game? Yeah, sometimes. But during the game, I won't think about this. And after your game today, you had to go to the anti-cheating protocols. Uh, what did they ask you to do there? Uh, he just checked my coat, my bodies, and my crutch. Right, you have these additional crutches they have to check. So did they just uh, use the metal detector to go over the crutches? Uh, he just checks the crutch. I just sit there. I think in some James Bond films, the crutches are actually a gun. <laughs> have you seen those films? No, no. Okay. No. Well, your crutches are just crutches. And, and finally, with one round to go, how do you rate China's chances for winning, I guess it would be your second team gold medal in only a couple of years? Of course, with, with today's win, we have much better chance comparing to uh, the previous round. But still, the last round will be, we'll, we'll meet very strong opponent. Indeed you will. Well, you beat Poland today. Nobody else was able to do that. And I want to thank Ding Loren, who did that entire interview on one foot. So you're an athlete and a chess player. Thanks for your time. Thank you. Thank you.